morning viewer welcome to our perspective here's the breaking news yes u.s president joe biden would speak to the american people on his priority the economy yeah in a speech in the state of maryland on thursday the white house on wednesday rejected baseless allegations of wrongdoing against u.s president joe biden after republican lawmakers launched an impeachment inquiry against him while the 80 year old democrat remained silent when asked by reporters about the probe his spokeswoman pushed back against the investigation by his political foes they have spent all year investigating the president and have turned up with no evidence none that he did anything wrong biden's press secretary Karen Jen Perer told reporters, "That's because the president did not do anything wrong." Republican House Speaker Kevin McCarthy bowed to intense pressure from his party's hard right and authorized the launch on Tuesday of an impeachment investigation. Republican House members accused Biden, a Democrat, of having lied to the American people about his son Hunter's controversial business dealings abroad. But Jen. PRA said Republicans did not even have enough support for a vote in the House to approve an impeachment probe. Even House Republicans have said the evidence does not exist, she said. This is a political stunt. The probe comes as Biden faces low poll ratings ahead of a likely rematch with former President Donald Trump in next year's presidential election. Biden ignored impeachment questions from reporters at the White House while leading a meeting of his Cancer cabinet, which aims to eradicate the disease, part of a recent effort by the administration to put the focus back on his domestic agenda. Cancer is personal for Biden, whose eldest son, Bew, died from brain cancer aged 46 in 2015. Biden had a cancerous skin lesions removed in February, while doctors removed two from First Lady Jill Biden a month before. Biden has stood resolutely by his sole surviving son, Hunter, 53. The younger Biden's business dealings in Ukraine and China, while his father was vice president under Barack Obama, have been a constant target of Republicans. Hunter Biden, a recovering drug addict, is currently under investigation by a Justice Department Special Counsel for possible tax evasion and is expected to be charged by the end of this month on a firearms violation. However, he has not been charged with crimes related to his foreign business dealings and no credible evidence has emerged so far that the president was involved in anything illegal. The probe, however, threatens to distract the White House and give Republicans fresh material for attacks ahead of the November 2024 election. Bien the Zifo, Fosak TV.